Okay, so so I, I would I, I would uh, the word you use are skills, right? Uh, because uh, th there's something about skills, uh, which is how you do things, and there's something about knowledge, uh, is things you know, uh, epistemy and technique, right? Uh, it's about knowledge and how you do things, and ultimately it will be about wisdom and mindset. So, so let's talk about skills first, right? Uh, in today's world. And this applies to many of you, but not all of you. Uh, I, I would want to get a couple of steps ahead uh, in terms of data science, uh, machine learning, AI. Uh, and because those are skills, right? Those are skills, yeah? Uh, to acquire them, because I think they are fundamental uh, to the world of uh, cognitive and quantitative uh, aspects uh, of solving problems and we are supposed to be uh, masters in this yeah so you got to get their skills yeah so in the area of skills uh, uh, it, it is so about digital skills uh, innovation skills and creative skills yeah uh, innovation and creative skills could be about design thinking uh, or six thinking hats uh, and and digital skills could be about understanding uh, variables, internet of things, yeah. So th those are still skills, right? Or even language skills, right? It it's helpful to have an additional language, right? Depending on your interest. So those are skills, yeah. Okay, but then if you move into domains of knowledge, right? Uh, depending on your interest, right? Uh, if, if you are in investments, I would like my, to get my head around things like negative interest rates, right? Uh, behavioral finance right if you're in general insurance i would like to get my head around uh, platform economics is about how platform companies like google uh, and facebook uh, thrive yeah thrive uh, so this is around knowledge right uh, uh, if i am in life and health insurance uh, and savings about behavioral finance and what about genetics right genetics is very important because it impacts uh, risk and underwriting and the longevity aspect. What about epidemiology? What about climate science? Yeah. So th these are areas of interest which are adjacent uh, to where actuaries practice, right? Uh, so so the skills, the domains of knowledge, uh, but, but, but I think in many ways, it's not just skills and domains of knowledge, right? But it's also a mindset which will come later. Uh, uh, but in terms of domains of knowledge, I'm trying to identify firstly skills, which are things you can learn to do. Uh, but domains of knowledge is about things which is helpful to know, to know, yeah, uh, as an actuary, uh, to talk authoritative, authoritative as an actuary. Then we can come to mindsets. Uh, maybe I could address it in other questions which you are going to ask me.